Hey guys, and welcome to this video on the Salesforce.com platform. So I am on the Salesforce Classic. You, to switch to Lightning, you can just click on the switch to Lightning experience here. But in this video, I want to show you guys how to delete records from an object. So we're going to click on your name, and then we're going to go to the developer console. And then a window is going to pop up for the developer console here. Now what we want to do is click query editor here. And I'm going to write a query to show the data in my custom object that I want to delete records from. So we're going to select the ID, we're going to select the name, the age, uh, underscore, underscore C, the department, underscore, underscore C, and the hourly rate, underscore, underscore C, from our custom object called engineer. And because it's a custom object, we have to have under underscore underscore C as well. So I'm going to go ahead and click execute down here and we're going to get back a whole bunch of data. So we get back 1,470 rows of data um, after we make that query. Now in order to delete all of this data we need to go up here to uh, debug and we're going to open execute anonymous window and you can see here I've written a statement similar to this before already. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this uh, query that I created down here. And I'm going to copy it. And I'm going to paste it right here. And I'm going to limit, limit it to 10,000 because I believe uh, there is a limit on how many records can be deleted at once. So if you have like 500,000 records, you could uh, come up with you could you could have some type of error here. So I'm gonna limit it to ten thousand for now. Um, the number of records I have is one thousand four hundred seventy, so this should not matter too much. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and click execute. So we just click uh we type delete, and then we have our query of the data that we want to delete, and I limit the row to uh, the limit I limit the number of rows to be deleted to ten thousand. So we're going to go ahead and click on execute here. All right, so it's executing it. All right, so I'm going to exit out this window and let's execute this query down here again. So I'll click execute. And now we see that we have no more data in our engineer object. So that's basically it. So thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave any questions you have in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And as always, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.